Good morning. This devotion is for October 21st, and we're still on the topic of hope. And today's verse is from Psalm 130, and it begins at verse 5. I wait for the Lord, my soul waits, and in his word I put my hope. My soul waits for the Lord more than the watchmen wait for the morning. O Israel, put your hope in the Lord, for with the Lord is unfailing love, and with him is full redemption. And the title for today's devotion is, Hope May Require Some Waiting. Well, I don't know if any of you have ever worked the, the third shift, the midnight shift, um, but it's tough. And when he refers to the watchman waiting for the morning, he's talking about that that terrible, stressful position of, number one, of being a watchman. But for goodness sake, it's much easier to be a watchman during the day than it is in the evening. I remember working security when I was going to college, and the night shifts were always so tough. One, because your body, you're trying to stay awake, but two, you see everything in minimal light. It's, you're seeing everything in grays and darknesses. And so it's tough to concentrate and it's tough to see and your imagination can play tricks on you. And, and, and just so just imagine that as a watchman waiting for the morning, as someone working the night shift is just waiting for the sun to come out to rejuvenate and to allow them to see better, sometimes faith and hope are the same way. Our faith has to hope in that light that's coming. See, it's not a blind hope. We're not, we're not hoping in the midst of darkness and wishing that something good would happen, but we're certain of God's unfailing love. We're certain of his faithfulness, and we know the sun is going to rise, and we know this darkness is going to lift, and we know there's going to be new coming. And so although we have to wait for it, I guess what I want to say in this devotion, it's worth the wait. Because God always causes the sun to shine, and he always brings the, the, the truth of his word, and he always fulfills his promises, and in that, we have a certain hope. Well, I pray that this devotion is a blessing to you, and have a firmly rooted day.